Hello everyone, welcome to Target CUET General English episode. Let's begin with previous day's practice question. Question was, when will supper be ready is A or an declarative sentence, interrogative sentence, exclamatory sentence or imperative sentence? The correct answer is option B, interrogative sentence. An interrogative sentence is a sentence that asks a question to gain information about something. It always ends with a question mark. Now let's begin today's session. First question is, select the correct synonym of the given word bewilder, calm, enlighten, baffle or explicate. The correct answer is option C, baffle. The word bewilder means cause someone to become perplexed and confused. Its synonyms are mystify, bemuse and baffle. Next question is spot the error in the following sentence. One of the assistant was a myth. One of the assistant was a myth, no error. The correct answer is option B, assistant. The error in the sentence is the incorrect use of the word assistant. The phrase one of the indicates that there is more than one assistant. Hence, the correct sentence should be as follows. One of the assistants was Amit. Next question is select the word which means the same as the group of words given below. Having high moral standards, virago, versatile, virtuous or volatile. The correct answer is option C, virtuous. The word virtuous refers to having a good moral qualities and behavior. It describes a person who possesses and practices virtues such as honesty, nobility, integrity and righteousness. Next question is fill in the blank with the correct preposition. The shepherd soon lost sight of them dash the darkness. Add in with insight. The correct answer is option B, in. The correct preposition to use in this sentence is in. We use in to indicate being inside or within a particular space or condition. Next question is choose the appropriate antonym of the word given below, remunerate. Accord, deny, pay, reimburse. The correct answer is option B, deny. The word remunerate means pay someone for services rendered or work done. Its antonyms are charge, withhold and deny. Next question is select the correct meaning of the given idiom or phrase down for the count. Tired, sick, sad, ready. The correct answer is option A, tired. The phrase break a leg is an idiomatic expression used to wish someone good luck before a performance or event. The phrase is used to convey encouragement and positive wishes. Next question is, choose the correct part of speech of the highlighted word in the following sentence. Why didn't you tell him about the books? Highlighted word is about. Adjective, adverb, conjunction or preposition. The correct answer is option D, preposition. In the given sentence, the word about functions as a preposition. It shows the relationship between the verb tell and the noun phrase, the books. Prepositions often indicate location, direction, time or manner. Next question is change the sentence into indirect speech. He said to me, I don't believe you. 
he said he didn't believe me he said he doesn't believe me he said he was not believed me or he said he will never believe me the correct answer is option a he said he didn't believe me when the reporting verb is in the past tense the simple present in the direct becomes the past simple in the indirect don't changes to didn't next question is did you tell him how it makes you feel is a or an declarative sentence interrogative sentence exclamatory sentence or imperative sentence the correct answer is option b interrogative sentence an interrogative sentence is a sentence that asks a question to gain information about something it always ends with a question mark last question is fill in the blank with the most suitable alternative the woman has a dash problem serious serene sullen or sacred The correct answer is option A serious. The complete sentence should be as follows. The woman has a serious problem. Now it's time for the practice question. Choose the incorrectly spelt word. Astronomical assumption, assessment or asymmetrical. Send the answer of this question in the comment section. Stay tuned for the next episode. Thanks for watching.